think it's time for a new project. Let's get started. You've seen this PC before on my channel. This is a Dell Inspiron Xeno HD Model 410. Uh, I originally got this to use as a home theater PC and I never really got around to doing much with it other than loading some software on it and uh, doing some testing. And uh, after doing some research I actually think I've identified a better solution for what I need and what I want for a home theater PC or a home theater setup anyways. So I'm gonna uh, handle that separately and I'll put that in another video of course but uh, for now I've got this little PC laying around and rather than getting rid of it I'm actually think I'm gonna use it for a project that I've been wanting to do for a long time uh, and I actually think this, this will be perfect before Xbox, PlayStation, and Nintendo, uh, at least when I was a kid anyways, you had to go to an arcade to play video games. And when I was growing up, I thought that was the coolest thing, and I always wanted to have an arcade cabinet at home, and I thought that would be just awesome. So uh, now, I actually have the ability to build one on my own, and over the next few videos, I'm going to try and do that and show you how that works out. Inside this Dell is a AMD Athlon 2 P340. It's a dual core processor running at 2.2 gigahertz. It's got 3 gigs of memory, a 250 gig hard drive, and it's running Windows 7 Home Professional. Uh, I think this is going to be a really good starting point to run a piece of software called MAME. Uh, MAME is, uh, stands for Multiple Arcade Machine Emulator, and that's actually the software that will let us run the arcade titles on a Windows box. Here's a plan for the project. I'm going to try and get this documented as best as I can over the course of the next few weeks. Uh, but real life being what it is and schedules uh, at being as busy as they are for me, uh, as they tend to be, uh, I can't promise that I'm going to have one video after another having to do with the uh, project. But I will try to get these out way more current uh, and way more often than, say, like my PBX project. Um, you know, so there's that. Secondly, uh, I'm going to go over uh, the uh, the build, obviously. So the software piece, which is MAME, and a piece of software that I'm going to use called Hyperspin, which I'll I'll talk about in another video. Uh, the building of the cabinet itself, uh, as well as all of the hardware for the cabinet. So all of the uh, switches and buttons and joysticks and all the wiring that goes with that. Uh, and, you know, we'll see how that goes. Uh, I think that uh, it's going to be a fun project. I think it's going to be pretty cool to put up on the channel. And I'm hoping you guys stick around and, um, and, uh, and watch and subscribe and like because that always helps me out. Uh, definitely let me know what you think um, in the comments below because uh, I, I like the interaction. And uh, for sure, if you guys have any uh, input or any kind of uh, suggestions on anything, uh, it's always appreciated. Uh, also check the description below for links to Twitter and Google+. Follow me there and you'll get updates on, uh, on these videos. So as always guys, thanks for watching. See you next time. Not an expert. I know I say that a lot in my videos, but you know I always want to point out that I'm learning how to do this. Um, uh,